Hey guys, Wilbur we'll here, and today I'm going to be showing you how you can obtain the Elemental Plunger on the new map, Derizon Drax. So I'm just going to be showing you how you can actually do it, and what it actually does. So what it does is that once you actually have this Elemental Plunger, you can one-hit Panzers, and they die. So today, I'm just going to be taking you through a quick tutorial showing you how you can get this Plunger. So as always, if you enjoy this video and want to see more, be sure to smash a like on it. Shows you guys really support my videos. Subscribe to my channel for the daily Black Ops 3 Zombies videos. And let's get in to the tutorial, guys. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is go up to the clock tower and shoot this red sign on one of the walls. Once you've done that, bricks will fall and gears will be shown out of the wall. So what you're going to need to do after that is get gravity spikes, also known as the Ragnarok DG4s, and throw them down. Once you have done that, that means you can go and activate this lever, which allows you to change the time on the clock. Now you're going to need to change the clock to 935. It is stuck at 115, that's why you got to change it to 935. And it does take about 5 to 10 minutes, so you will have to wait, but it is completely worth it to get this plunger. As you can see, I've sped up the gameplay, so once it's at 935, you go down to the MPD area, and you have to do this secret little step. So once you're down at the MPD area, you're actually going to need to wall run and hit this secret little wisp. If you guys know on the Easter egg, you actually have to hit up a few wisps to activate half of the Easter egg. You're going to need to do the same thing with these panels, so just jump from left to right on these panels and then you'll be moving on to the next step. And with that next step, you will teleport into Dr. Groff's little laboratory. So once you are in there, you have to go up and find the plunger. So just pick that up real sweet and easy. And once you teleport back, you will have the plunger to use. So if you actually want to see yourself using that plunger, you just got to press circle. Uh, which is your melee, and you do use the plunger. Your friend, who you're also playing with, if you are playing on co-op, also gets the plunger. So the next step is a key to actually completing this tutorial. What you're going to need to do is either wait until round 12 or spawn in a panzer by any chance, and you're going to need to kill the panzer. Now, in the gameplay, you see Greg actually kill the panzer with the plunger. Turns out you actually don't need to uh, kill the panzer with the plunger. You just need to kill the panzer in general, and then you will receive the elemental plunger. Now once you have received this plunger, what it does is that once you have actually got it, you can go up to a panzer and one hit them. It has fire coming out of the end, it's really cool and it's really good if you're going for high rounds, say if you're capping, going for a round 80 attempt, you can just have this plunger and when the panzer spawns in, boom, there he is, he's dead, it's amazing. I just thought I would bring this tutorial for you guys, it's a quick and simple one. I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you do, be sure to smash that like button. And I want to know what you guys think of this plunger. Is it good? Do you guys like it? Do you not? I just really want to know. So comment it down in the comments section. So thank you for watching this video, guys. I will see you in the next one. Peace out and goodbye.